John 14 verse 27 says, Peace I leave with you, my peace I give to you. Now that's not just to us, but it's for others too. And especially when we're thinking about world peace. We often think if only two countries could come together, if they could communicate. Well, there is a communication that is above words. It is a spiritual communication that all people, no matter what language, no matter what belief, they can tap into, they can feel, and it is something that can uplift the individual in both places. Today we pray for the world. We pray for a world that is enfolded in God's love and peace. Do you ever wonder what good it does for you as just one person in a world of seeming challenge? to pray for peace. You're just one person. You might say, what can I do? How can I make a difference? Well, the answer is very simple. Through prayer, you're doing more good than you could ever imagine. And you're not doing it alone. Not at all. Right now, there are literally millions of others around the whole world that are praying for peace just as you are. And it is setting up a spiritual energy that anyone that consents to it in their free will can tap into. Each time that you pray for world peace, you're joining with all the others who are visualizing a harmonious, peace-filled planet. United prayer. United prayer is powerful, and it is building a spiritual foundation of peace. And I believe that when enough people join together in a spirit of peace, the world will have to change. So keep on praying. Keep on visualizing peace and a better world. You are making a difference, my friend, when you do so. A very peaceful difference. May God bless you.